Night Nation, a year ago we rolled out Mission 12. Our roadmap consisting of six objectives to successfully transition UCF athletics into the Big 12 Conference and lay out our vision for the future. With your support, we've made great progress. And a year later, these mission objectives stay the same with one addition. We aim to provide the best services for our student athletes and experiences for our fans. I'd like to take a few minutes to provide an update on Mission 12 objectives. In order to meet these objectives, we're going down four parallel tracks that address personnel, operating budgets, capital projects, and recruiting as we transition into the Big 12. Here is your Mission 12 update. Starting with our newest objective, we must fully support our student athletes in their NIL endeavors. Name, image, and likeness is a topic that has rapidly changed the landscape of intercollegiate athletics. While the statutes in each state vary, updated guidance from the NCAA now allows UCF athletics to promote collectives who represent our student athletes with NIL opportunities. We ask that you support the Kingdom NIL, an official sponsor of UCF athletics that was founded by a group of trusted and passionate alumni in Varsity Knights. The Kingdom is actively partnering with many of your favorite student athletes and your support of the Kingdom is critical for the most accomplished student athletes in the country. The next two objectives are to provide championship caliber services to our student athletes in their career pursuits and position UCF athletics to win conference and national championships. I said it when I arrived, we will be the only school in the country to guarantee 100% job and grad school placement to our graduating student athletes. I'm proud to say we have delivered on that promise as well as increased student athlete services in the ways of academics, mental health, nutrition, and global study opportunities. UCF student athletes extended their record setting streak in the classroom to 30 consecutive semesters with a department GPA of over 3.0 or better. 10 years ago, UCF athletics took a step up in competition transitioning from Conference USA into the American Athletics Conference. At that time, many of you responded to the call to support our athletics program at the next level. The result, UCF will be leaving the American with more conference titles than any other program in the history of the league. You should be proud because all of you were a big part of that accomplishment. As we make the jump to join a Power Five Conference, we face the reality that our current operating budget must grow, which leads us to our next three objectives. To successfully transition UCF athletics into the Big 12 Conference, increase the UCF athletics operating budget to be in the top half upon entry into the Big 12. Then target top third and to maximize self-generated revenue through ticket sales, charge on fund support, corporate partnerships, and other avenues. Again, in order to achieve our mission, it is imperative to rely on more than just an increase in the Big 12 Conference distributions. We must rely and increase our self-generated revenue. With your response to last year's Mission 12 All Call to donate, buy, support, we were able to set revenue records across the board. In tickets, Night Nation sold out football season tickets and set ticket revenue records in men's basketball, volleyball, baseball, and softball. A record 11,804 of you stepped up to make a gift to the Charge On Fund in 21 and 22 leading to an all-time high of 43.8 million in commitments and 17.7 .7 million in cash. In the last eight months, we received the two largest gifts in UCF athletics history, both over $5 million from the Hagel family and an anonymous varsity night. We have set an all-time record in licensing through merchandising sales, doubled our number of corporate sponsors, and signed a 13-year, $125 million multimedia rights agreement with Play5 Sports. All of this in addition to signing a new naming rights partner for the football stadium, FBC Mortgage, and extended addition financial as the naming right partner of the arena. As you can hear, your response to Mission 12 and the hard work of our staff has put us in a good position, but we still got some work to do. Despite a recent article you may have seen reporting a significant surplus for UCF athletics, this report was not a full financial picture of all of our expenses and excluded COVID-related debt. We are projecting our operating budget to grow from 72 million this year to approximately 90 million for our first year as a member in the Big 12. While we have come a long way in just 10 years, 
The budgets of our Big 12 peers have grown as well. The average operating revenue last fiscal year of the six public incumbent schools is nearly $110 million. UCF Athletics needs to aggressively continue to self-generate revenue. You should take great pride that we're by far the youngest university in the Power Five. In fact, only four other P5 universities were even established in the 1900s. But that means playing catch up to schools with 100 plus years a head start. With the increasing support of Orlando and Knight Nation, we will need to get our operating budgets in the top third of the league to equip us with the resources to compete for championships. This will position us well when we become a full share member of the Big 12 in fiscal year 26, meaning we get an equal share of the conference revenue distributions as the existing members do right now today. We expect to be competitive right away. So in the meantime, it is paramount that we make good fiscal decisions in order to financially transition our operation to the Big 12. Our path to increase self-generated revenue stays the same and our team is more determined than ever. Our next objective is to deliver unique indigenous athletics facilities for all student athletes and fans, starting with the UCF football campus. Since launching Mission 12, we've been able to update aspects of our team facilities for all 16 of our varsity sports, from new locker rooms, lounge areas, for our basketball and volleyball programs, to complete renovations of our softball clubhouse. Your support of Mission 12 is already having an impact, getting our team facilities ready for the Big 12. Visit mission12.com to see a full list of our team facility updates from the last 12 months. Within the Kenneth G. Dixon Athletics Village, we're committed to building unique facilities the right way. Being fiscally responsible with the money you entrusted to us, while we must continue to service the debt and maintain our current facilities, ongoing investment is essential to our continued success. In the summer of 2021, we unveiled initial concepts for a football campus on the south end of FBC Mortgage Stadium. We spent a lot of time meeting with architects and repurposing our needs, not just for now, but for the future that will benefit our student athletes, coaches, and fans for decades to come. I'm thrilled to unveil the updated vision of the football campus now called the Sharon and Mark Hagel Football Gateway. Phase one of the gateway is mission critical and consists of Nicholson Plaza, a tropical entrance and tailgate zone, a new state-of-the-art building to house our football operations, meeting rooms, and coaches' offices, a complete renovation to the existing football building, including a new football locker room, weight room, training room, and other team facilities. And of course, McNamara Cove, featuring the Recovery River and hydrotherapy pools for our student athletes. McNamara Cove will also be the home of Cove gating on football game days, recruiting and alumni events, and corporate hours. The Sharon and Mark Hagel Football Gateway will not only change the way we recruit, and operate, but also create a brand new activation area on game day and an additional grand entry into FBC Mortgage Stadium. We'll be working with President Cartwright and UCF Board of Trustees on timelines, but in the meantime, we'll continue to seek capital donations from these projects. Phase two is our vision for a brand new tower on the west side of the bounce house. The tower will be the home to the launch club, suites, and countless new unique premium seating opportunities. The size and structure of the tower will also help create much needed shade for significant parts of FBC Mortgage State. The tower is not only imperative to the fan experience, but to create new revenue streams to help us advance Mission 12. When will these projects be complete? That's up to all of us. Phase one is mission critical and must be completely funded before starting work on the football tower. We have to be cautious not to leverage our financial future with accumulating more debt. So Night Nation, City of Orlando, we need private and public support to move these projects forward. Your part in the mission is to continue to donate, buy, support, and help us strategically build a larger community of stakeholders whose common interest is advancing UCF athletics mission, vision, and competitive success on and off the field. We urge you to continue to donate to the Big 12 Transition Fund, monthly or one-time gifts to the Charge On Fund at any level. Join the Shareholder Society $5,000 or more annually for five years. Become a Big 12 founder at five million plus in lifetime giving. Buy season tickets for all sports and UCF merchandise. Support, help support our student athletes in their NIL endeavors through the kingdom. Support our corporate partners. If you are a business owner, become a corporate partner. There's even an opportunity for you to be a Big 12 corporate founder with a $10 million plus partnership. 
Thanks for listening to the latest update in Mission 12. Go Knights, and let's charge on together.